Welcome to my channel. I'm Work and Travel and in this video it goes about Kazakhstan and my first impression. And also a new chapter starts. So I hope you enjoy this and I would say let's go right into it. My last days in Georgia motivate me for my further trip. I spent two days with Martin and Betty, who are also on a trip through the world. How do we say? We should leave when it's the most beautiful. Which makes leaving Georgia a little bit easier for me. Supplied with a drink, I return to Tbilisi with a fast driving style that I have become accustomed to in Georgia. Then get my nose tickled and my stay comes to an end. I finally came to Kazakhstan. And now we, I think I will try to find a sleeping place before, yeah, I can show you my first impression of Kazakhstan. So let's see what we can find here. And I need to orientate myself first because now everybody wants to give me a taxi ride, but I don't want this because I want a sleeping place. Yeah, this is how it looks. <laughs> and I feel like it will look like this next 10 kilometers. So why should I walk further if it doesn't change? It doesn't, it doesn't go anywhere, only to the lights in the back. But I don't know what it is, it's like street lights or... Okay, let's stop. Stop, 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 dun, 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 stop. It will be not better. Okay, here we are. My sleeping place. Yeah, it's morning and I got picked up directly where I slept and got brought to the, to the ocean, to the Black Sea. <laughs> and I think we go and drink some chai. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> the gas pipes are even bigger. <laughs> I don't know if you saw my Georgian videos, there are the gas pipes not as big as here. And they work at the airport and make the bagage uh, unloading and loading. So actually I think they had all, also my bagage because they were working the last 12 hours and this is the time when I arrived. <laughs> Quite funny. And now I'm driving with him. Oh! <laughs> yeah. <Yeah>. Nice! <laughs> so this is really a tasty chocolate from Kazakhstan. <laughs> Good morning! <laughs> and it's like I come in a country where chai gets drinking a lot. We have like these nice cups. So many chocolate different ones. And so after a while you know which one are the best ones. Yeah, we are here now in Aktau in the city where the um, airport also is destined. But it's so windy today, so it's not so easy to enjoy this as much. But we will show a little bit around. Here we just changed the or well, we repaired the tire because it was like one hole and yeah it's so funny like it was like i don't know it doesn't cost too much access so interesting i think the phone number like how you can see it here is where you send your money so they make a lot of things um, with your phone so it's like an electronic way of payment i know we have visa cards and uh, cash but a lot of things they pay with a phone they just scan like an QR code or they just uh, yeah send the money on a special phone number. Yeah this is like Kurt. Kurt, yeah? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's like a yeah, special Kazakh um, kind of cheese ball. It's made out of milk. It can be like in this case it's from camel and it's like really salty and it's like quite hard. So it's like you can bite it slowly or just like like yeah melt it on your tongue. 
and it's really, really rich of the taste. So it's nice. <laughs> uh, for beer, maybe. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. So that's why uh, the young people, even young people, uh, eat this mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. product. Mm -hmm. Because good. it's salty. Because of beer, like, yeah. It's like a good um, snack for, um, for beer. Yeah, that's true. It was not, it was not too much. Uh, Popular, mm -hmm. uh, famous food yeah. before. Yeah. Uh, when it comes uh, beer and uh, more people, more young people uh, comes drink beer mm -hmm. and uh, yeah. it's it's uh, same time it comes uh, more popular. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Cool. <laughs> yeah. This is next morning, and I'm in Akta also, so I go out of Akta today, and yeah. What can I say? To my first impression. I still need money, so I can show you this when I got this. And definitely the hospitality is much stronger. And I feel like people can uh, feel much more what I need. It is, looks like European standard of what you get. Like if you see all the different alcohol, like this is untypical. Like in Georgia you couldn't get such big stores <laughs> with also vodka. <laughs> I think this is only vodka, like this whole session. So there's, <laughs> it's vodka from prices from three euros till I don't know six euros. So all of them are really cheap. Vodka? Oh, vodka goes over to water. <laughs> and this is like the where I come from. It's Gerolsteiner. It's like uh, yeah, German water comes to here. Interesting, interesting. I got 22 euros, what equals 10,000 tenge, the Kazakh's currency. This means 1 euro is equal to 450 tenge. The size of the bills are 500, 1000, 2000, 5000 and 10,000. But it's not the Black Sea anymore, it's the Baltic Sea. Stone coast, so it's protected already, but it's good. So we can see this beauty and gets not destroyed by any yeah, stupid concrete landscape architecture. Jonathan. Hi, Germania. Nice to meet you. Yeah, it's Alexander. Uh, yeah, just met him. Anyway, I wanted to show this pipeline because, yeah, we are now in a country where a lot of oil also comes from. You only can tank gas. It's 45. If you remember, I said like one euro is 450. So this means like 10 cent is one liter of gas, what is like nothing. <laughs> yeah, makes sense if you have oil next to you or under you, underneath, why should you pay more? And also the benzene, benzene is I think 50 cent or 40 cent. So here is nothing with gas inflation prices. <laughs> My name is Bacha. Bacha. We are going to show, what's your name bro? Uh, Jonathan. Jonathan. Yeah. We are going to show Jonathan whole monkey stuff. So we are starting to, first of all, from the cafe up here. Yeah, this is like what I just told before, how nice it is to meet Kazakh people and how my yeah, impression I gets guess. changed. <laughs> I guess. Alaikum. Alaikum salam. Hello Muslim. Jonathan, yeah? No. This is my brother Mucha. Oh, Jim Friatna. He is coming from Germany. Germany? Yeah. So, so we are <laughs> nice going to touch. this beautiful colors and like this different things what you can see here like typical this is for the horse like this lash sword and yeah they're mostly Islam so you will see a lot of what is from the Islam religion and 
yeah. Look at this. Actually, the beauty is in the top. So if you look at the roof, and there's like this wooden structure. What do you have? Uh, what is like the like the main support for the roof, and then you have all the fabric on top. And it's even winterproof, so the walls can be really thick, and then they sleep in the winter times inside. Yes. So we enter the, from here, yeah. Mm -hmm. So the main guest is sitting here. The most and at the top. Place for, for okay. Yeah. We call it tour. Tour. So, <laughs> Welcome to Kazakhstan, yeah, guys. Bro. Kazakhstan. Welcome Woo! to Akta. We are waiting for you. <laughs> Yes. Whole season, whole month, <laughs> whole summer. <laughs> Thank you so much. This is how fast I got integrated <laughs> in this country. <laughs> we call them butter. Butter? Yeah. It's like my. Fighting for our. For your country. For yeah. Yeah. Nice. Uh, yeah. Cool. Mm. It's like kumis, a little bit. Camels. Kumis, kumis. Kumis, not like kumis. Not kumis. But kumis is horse milk. Oh yeah. Horse milk. Okay. Yeah. It's camels milk. It has like a sour taste, but it's um, yep, 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 yep. a little bit like yogurt. If you never tried it, you would maybe compare it a little bit to this. Yeah, only two, also two types of shubat. Mm -hmm. uh, one is uh, spicy. Spicy, yes. One is spicy, mm -hmm. one is tasty. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So this is tasty. Yeah, it's really tasty. Yeah. This is tasty. I, I like spicy one. Uh, Samsa, and then like this is a national uh, food plof, what is also like from Kyrgyzstan and Uzbekistan, I think. The Samsa is actually one of my favorite. Um, it's like a bag with inside with meat or potatoes and onions. And yeah, I think we will enjoy our food and then we'll see where we go next. <laughs> we are back in a country with Chai culture. So instead of Georgia, where wine is served all the meals. So now you get chai every time. When Kazakh was starting, Kazakh nation, mm -hmm. these three, our big bros, three presidents was. Okay, this yeah. He was the head of our nation. Yeah. Kazakh, Tulebi, ITKB. All three together? Yeah, yeah they were three together. Okay. So in our region, mm -hmm. it's uh, so we're divided in three uh, rules. We call it rule. One is young brother, yeah. one is middle brother, and one is yeah. old brother, yeah. yeah. So this old brother, so the north of Kazakhstan, mm -hmm, yeah. in Astana, Nur Sultan, Havada, the middle and the small. We are Batas region, mm -hmm. the west region. Yeah. We are from ITKB. Okay. Yeah. So this is our grandfather. Ah. This was really good food, and I feel like the best first Kazakh impression. And I hope you enjoyed this. And I would say we end this video, and you'll see the other part of my next video so subscribe and leave me a like if you like this and i would say see you in my next one bye <laughs>